now we are discussing the topic constructing the binary tree from the arithmetic expression if arithmetic expression is given to us then out of that we has to construct a binary tree that is we are going to learn here now here we are saying that e denote the following arithmetic expression that means e is a arithmetic expression here and e signify some of the expression like a minus b slash in the bracket c into d plus e and the question that is asking that construct the binary tree t of e e is a arithmetic expression and from that expression we has to find out the tree now how to construct the tree first of all we are going to write the expression here now we are having the expression with us which is arithmetic expression and we has to create the tree from it now to understand this we has to first of all understand the terminology of the binary tree the tree says that we always have a parent so this is the node which is a parent and there we are having the left and the right children sometime right children can be there or sometime right or left can be there or it may not be there that depend because the binary tree means two child maximum it can be zero child one child or two child so here we are going to find out the parent first so out of this expression we has to find out which can be the parent or can we divide into three parts so here we can see that this whole is the one part because that is into the bracket this slash is the another part and this one is the another part so here successfully we have found the three parts and we can say that if this one is the parent means node then this will be the left subtree and this will be the right subtree so if i mark the entry here into this particular node then obviously it will be the slash and this will be a minus b and then further there we are having into double bracket c into d then afterward it will be plus e so successfully we have find the parent out of this expression now similar way we are going to break it up into different different parts and then we are working with the tree construction arithmetic expressions are always written into the in order in order means the parent will always be in between the left and right that's why from this expression the slash is considered as the parent because always the middle one will be the parent and left will be the left child and right will be the right child now we are going to break this particular expression further now we are considering the left portion so this one is the left portion here now talking about this left portion we are considering here that is a minus b i am removing it from the bracket because now if i am taking only with this expression then bracket is not required again out of that we are trying to divide into three parts so this one is the first part this is the second part and the third part we know that arithmetic expression is like the infix expression where we are having the middle one is the parent so that's why this one will be the left child this will be the right child and this will be the node node we are considering like it is the parent so now it is a time for extending the node and constructing the left and right subtree now we have added two further nodes here and we know that the left side the left we have considered that is a so a is mentioned here right side we are having is b and above we are having is minus i have written a b and minus inside the circle because there is no further extension possible because a minus b is now sold so left hand side is completely sold here now left side the tree is properly constructed now this is the time to construct the right hand side of the tree so now is the time to take this expression which is the right side expression so i am writing here which was left i am removing the brackets because that is no more required bracket outer brackets i am talking about so c into d this is inside the inner bracket then plus e so this is now the expression 
We know that the arithmetic expression is like the infix expression. So here the middle will be the parent. So I will try to break it into three parts. So here this one I am having then second part and third part. So three parts we have breaked. The middle one will be the parent and left and the right. So successfully we have find the parent which is plus and the left child is C into D and the right one is E. So by this we are going to construct the tree now. So now we have added the two child here and we know that the middle one is the parent. So parent is nothing but the plus. Now afterward we are having the right portion which is the E. So there is only single right child I have written inside the circle. Now talking about the left child, left child still it is the expression which is C into D. So I am writing outside that means I has to solve it. So this is remaining. Now is the time to solve the C into D. Now we are solving the left portion which is remaining and which is C into D. Now this is we are going to solve. So this I am writing here C into D. The bracket is removed because this is a single expression, brackets are not required. We are having the binary tree and the binary tree is having the property of the three things. One is left, then node and the right. So divide into three parts, one, two and three. The arithmetic expression is the infix expression. So middle will be the parent. So this one is the parent that is a node left child and the right child. So this is the time to construct the two nodes where the C and D will come. Now two nodes are constructed. Here we know that the middle one is the parent. So star is the parent here. Now the left child is C and the right child we are having is D. So this is the binary tree which is constructed. And with the help of the arithmetic expression, we have constructed the binary tree. So this one is the final binary tree, which is constructed from the arithmetic expression. Whenever we are constructing a binary tree from the arithmetic expression, we should note few points. The first point is we should try to divide the arithmetic expression into three parts because the binary tree is having the relation of parent, left child and the right child. Now these three parts again should be having the things means middle one will be the parent left will be the left child and right will be the right child this procedure we has to follow and we can easily construct the binary tree from the arithmetic expression so that is all about the constructing binary tree from arithmetic expression